Good morning, friends. I'm really glad to see you all here today. Do you know that now for six Sundays, we've been talking about Jesus and many, many different words we've used to describe him. We're going to go through them real quickly. I was going to give you a quiz, but then I thought, I don't think most of the people out there could get the right answers if I did a quiz, so I'm not going to put you guys on the spot. We'll just do them together, okay? Friend, teacher, savior, Lord, and way. So that's our first five. And this morning, I'm wondering if you've ever heard this big word, Emmanuel. Emmanuel. Anybody ever heard that word? Emmanuel? Yeah? I haven't. When do you think you've heard it? Uh, in the play? In the play. Yes, you're right. That's exactly right. At Christmas time, we use that word a lot. In fact, we sing a hymn, O Come, O Come, Emmanuel. It's a big word, but I love what it means, and so I wanted to share it with you all today. Are you ready for what it means? Emmanuel means God is with us. And that's one of the ways we talk about Jesus, that Jesus is God with us. Because we know and we love Jesus, we believe that God is always with us. So God is with us in Jesus, Emmanuel. I want to see if we can all say that one time real loud together, Emmanuel. You ready? One, two, three. Emmanuel. God is with us. So we're going to use the same prayer we've been using through this whole series, and we're going to start with our prayer clap and then repeat. Are you ready? One, two, three. (laughs) Dear God, God, help me see what you see. Help me me love the way you love. 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 In In Jesus' name, amen. All right, next week, brand new things. We've done six weeks. Awesome job, guys. You can go out that way. 